Let's see if we can write the fraction 11 over 25, or we could call it 11 25ths, to see if we can write that as a decimal. And we're going to round it to the nearest thousands place. And so another way of viewing this, 11 over 25, this is the same thing as 11 divided by 25. So we can literally say, we can literally divide 25 into 11, and whatever we get, that is going to be the decimal representation of 11 25ths. And since we're going to go into the, the, in, into the places less than the ones place, we're going to go into the tenths place, and the hundredths place, and the thousandths place, let's add some zeros to this 11 right over here after the decimal. And now let's start to divide. 25 doesn't go into 1. 25 doesn't go into 11. 25 does go into 110. So when 25 goes into 110 four times, four times 25 is 100. So it goes into it four times. Let's keep the decimal up here. So we'll write 0 0.4. 4 times 25 is 100. And now we can subtract. 110 minus 100 is 10. And now we can bring down another 0. 25 goes into 100 exactly four times. 4 times 25 is 100. And then you subtract, and you get 0. So we actually didn't even have to round this one. This fraction is exactly, this is exactly 0 0.44.